The Vatican yeah. is highly, highly involved with the mafia, La Cosa Nostra in Italy, the organized crime, organized drug running, white slavery, uh, pornography, yeah. child abuse, and it's just an extraordinarily, like Steve Allen said, criminal organization that's been around yeah. for centuries, yeah. 1,600 years. For 1,600 years, the Vatican has ruled Europe. And for yeah. 1,600 years, Europe has ruled the world. And so that's why all roads lead to Rome. Yeah. If you go back into history, you'll find that Rome was at bottom line on all of the wars, the violence, the, the pornographic stuff going on in religion, even still today, and that nuns, according to the and according to the reference books, encyclopedias of religion, the nuns were originally the prostitutes of the cardinals. And the cardinals had their kept women, but they had to put them somewhere and take care of them and feed them. And they had to have a home because they were, they were being kept purposely individual prostitutes for individual cardinals. And so they developed in the Catholic Church a place to put all the prostitutes and they called it the, uh, they called them nuns. And that's why today we have the, uh, in the Catholic Church we have nuns the females who were married to the church. And, the, and when you say they're married to the church, they're married to Jesus. They're the bride of Jesus. And since the cardinals represent Jesus, therefore the cardinals can use the women as their wives. And so that's what has happened over the centuries, that the cardinals have used the prostitutes, which they call nuns. Yeah. And that's interesting because there's a history that most people do not know anything about. And that's why today in, in Islam, uh, another religion is doing the same thing. The women are all dressed in black, just like the Catholic nuns are dressed in black. And the Catholic nuns have long robes that cover them completely, just as they do in Islam. And uh, in Islam, they wear the covers over their face. Because if, according to the Bible, according to history, in Islam, when the women would wear a cover over their face, it was because they were prostitutes. Prostitutes were known in the Middle East to wear uh, scarfs and cloth, uh, cloth over their face so that you only see their eyes, only their eyes. And this way the women don't have to be ridiculed in public or being prosecuted prostitutes because nobody knows who they are and so that's why the today in islam women wear the covering over their face because that's what the bible says the bible says that the women wore scarves over their faces because they were prostitutes and they didn't want people to know who they were yeah. so that's what's happening today in islam the men are keeping their women as prostitutes just as the cardinals kept their prostitutes and called them nuns and yeah. the women still wear the black robes.